Hey there, hi there, ho there, everybody, and welcome to another Let's Play of The Outer Wilds. Modded content, of course. Uh, my name is Phantom Man. Pleasure to have you all aboard. Today we're going to be playing The Outsider by Streetlights Behind the Trees. I have been anxiously awaiting this mod for the game. Um, I've seen the trailer, and all I know is it adds a bunch of content to Dark Bramble. And judging by the uh, opening uh, title sequence here, um, there is some new content to even the main menu. Um, as you can see, I see a bunch of twisted rock structures around the campfire. Uh, the logo b beneath Outer Wilds has been changed to show the outsider. Um, I, I think it's a really cool feature. I know when I did the Vision playthrough with uh, uh, Harthian's mod, uh, it said the vision in green under there, and the fire was green. Uh, th this one, um, again, with the Outsider logo and the new menu features, uh, I, n I know this is going to be a very uh, well-done mod. So let's jump right into it. I haven't played through this before ever, so this is a blind playthrough. Uh, this mod did just come out, so if you haven't played it yourself, and you've only seen the trailer for it, I'd highly encourage you to do so. Uh, this is your one and only warning for spoilers. Uh, but yeah, let's just jump right in. Uh, it should take about uh, three hours, according to the mod page, to get through it. So we'll see if we can do that in one session. If not, we can break it up. But let's see what happens. All right. So far... Uh, it's just a regular Outer Wilds. Let's roast a marshmallow. Get a hang of the controls once again. Sensitivity's good. Perfectly. Perfectly cooked. Ah. Uh. Oh, hi Milo. <laughs> you gonna join me in an Outer Wilds adventure, Mr. Buddy? Hi. You wanna say hi to all the people at home? You wanna say hi to all the people? This is Milo. He's standing on the controller. <laughs> uh oh. Okay, go play. All right, to Dark Bramble. The most wholesome and fun planet in this entire solar system. All right, we'll see if the ship log has anything on it. Uh, nothing that I can see. Suit up. Dark Bramble is... Can I uh, select it? Yes, I can. Okay, here we go. Where is it? Ah, it's right there. Can I finally do autopilot? I can. It's looking, uh... brighter than usual. Almost even closer... than I remember it. See how... Was I rolling again? Yeah, this is how we roll. Okay, barring the interloper, I see a couple new structures around uh, Dark Bramble. Mainly that tower over there, and then this little floating structure here. So I want to see if I can land on this. This caught my eye first. And I want to see what this is. It looks no Mayan origin. Get close to it. Perfect. Alright, it's a little dark on this side. Let's see if I can land on it. I think it's a landing pad. I hope it's a landing pad.
Landing gear damaged. Uh oh. Okay. Um I see spikes. That's that's why it was damaged, okay? Can I go in? Nope. I'm guessing this is the back side of whatever I landed on. Hopefully my ship doesn't go that far away. Oh, there's stuff inside it. Ah, gravity, perfect. So I see no my writing. Bramble Power Station. That just turns stuff off. Okay. Finally finished building the stupid space station. Datura. These seed things are great. Saved having to build giant long cables everywhere. Okay, so they're using the uh, seeds as cables. Couldn't have done it without you, friend, and your ship. Ah, oh, we gotta figure out who the sh who the um who the friend is. Northern Observatory. The Northern Observatory? Like, on Brittle Hollow? And then this one goes to... Initial Campsite and Shuttle Cruiser. Okay. Study tower and projection pool house, okay. Coronal mass ejection. Gravity stability system has been damaged. Giant steep approaching in 14 minutes and 30 seconds. And it's going down. So I'm gonna collide with Giant's Deep. That's not good. What is this one? Bramble Village. And then I think this is the last one. Anglerfish Hunting Blind. Oh, that's fun. Okay, so what I've learned is this is a power station on course to collide with Giant Steep. Possibly before the sun explodes. And my ship is 300 meters away. I'll just launch a scout inside here. Let's see. Okay, I could go towards my ship. Or towards Dark Bramble and maybe find where all these things are connecting. My ship is getting further away. It'd be kind of cool if I could, like, accelerate towards, uh, places in Dark Bramble. Hmm. Oh, I hope I land on something soft. Land, land, land. Yes. Okay. Wait, what do we see inside here? Okay. There's definitely something in there. Three minutes of oxygen remaining. I think I saw trees in there. Yeah, there's trees. If I can get there in three minutes. see trees. Okay. Let me in. Oh, come on. 
Those trees don't do oxygen. Lammy, if you're reading this, then I assume you and your friends have returned to come snooping once again. Sorry, but you're out of luck. I now have two security measures to prevent you teens from getting in here. I know we encourage being curious and all, but this is not acceptable behavior, so aha, uh -huh, I have always wanted to say this. Get off my lawn. Northern Observatory. Okay, so there's security measures to prevent us from going inside this door. I'm almost out of fuel, almost out of oxygen. I don't know if I could land inside this thing. But my ship is floating further and further away. So many new things. I see some sort of twisty bridge. Obviously, there's a way inside. I could jump inside the seed myself, but I think, uh, I don't think that would work. So I think my options are to follow these paths and see if I can find a way in. Ow. I think this is a really cool concept. Um, street lights behind the trees did a very good job of utilizing the space in Dark Bramble with the ice on top because in the base game I don't think I spent like any time in the ice above the planet so yeah this is very cool and there's a thing over there okay I'm dying but I've learned things. I have learned things. A lot of information all at once, but th this is good. I'm liking my uh, trip so far. <sighs> Loop two. I wonder if the moth or the mod author planned running out of oxygen to like decrease the time spent on the loop. Ah uh, yes. Power station uses bramble seeds to connect all locations on dark bramble to a power source. Gravity stability system has been disabled. A recent coronal mass ejection from the sun that hit Dark Bramble. I need to sw uh, switch to turn off power to one of the locations. <gasps> if I turn off power to the Northern Observatory, does the door open? straight into the sun. Bye, sun. Say what you want about autopilot, but if I can turn the ship and look around and still go towards the planet, that's kind of fun. Look at that. Like, if you waste no time and go straight to the power station. Alright, can I 
match the velocity. Yes, I can. So let's find the entrance here. Yes, let's land on it this time. Perfect. A much better landing. Okay, which one of these was the Northern Observatory? This one. I'm just gonna turn. I'm just gonna turn the power off. No big deal. No, go in. Go in, please. Eh. Perfect. Okay, we're gonna use the ship so we keep our oxygen and fuel supplies going. Ah. Okay. So we turn the power off. Does it open the door? I don't think it did. It was definitely worth a shot to see if it opens the door. Yep. Okay. So clearly that didn't work. But we can explore the ice and roots below to see if there's a hidden way inside it. Another hypothesis I have and want to test is if I go inside... Hello? It's that one tent thing. What is... I've stuck the ship. I've stuck the ship. Okay, I guess we're... Uh... I guess we're here now. Where does this go? Initial campsite and shuttle crusher. Shuttle crusher? Anglerfish hunting blind. Oh, yeah, it is a pun. Because they're blind. They're blind. Ah. Ghost matter nearby? In this building, I'm hoping to catch an anglerfish because I'm hungry and losing my sanity. Uh-oh. Datura, are you okay? Repurpose the warp core from my shuttle to warp me just in case. J just in case. I've caught one, a small one, but I've caught one. It would seem sneaking around them works. They appear to be blind. Amazing discovery. Must tell the others immediately, surely. They'll have to consider my idea now. What is your idea? Also, I see the ghost matter. I also see there's a thing in the mouth. Somebody distract... Wait a minute, what's this? Can't wait to bring some of... This to my shelter at the South Pole. Okay, so there's a shelter at the South Pole. There could even be a person at the South Pole. Okay, what's this? Finally collected enough courage to start exploring the planet's insides. To adventure! I found Escape Pod 3. I managed to follow the lights. They left to a seed, surrounded by Nomai, who are all no longer with us. Eskal, our leader, was with them. I expected to feel anger upon seeing him again, but I wonder how he felt surrounded by his dying crew, knowing he had failed his entire clan and his rush to warp to the eye. And there was nothing he could do but wait and die. I feel sorry for him. Okay, so this person, Datura, lived longer than the 
the people on Escape Pod 3. But did you... Uh, survive the... What is this? It looks broken. Detour warp pad. Yarrow, why are you and Root planning to waste so much time and ease resources building giant towers for each warp pad? One tower is enough. I won't admit this idea to him, but it's a cool idea. But this one's broken. Okay, there's ghost matter over there. Datura seems... I, I don't know if Datura survived longer than the rest of the Nomai. to tell the others of my discovery, but when putting the projection stone in, I see Yarrow. So I tell him, and he was actually quite interested, enthused even. I argued we should use this knowledge to reach the vessel, which he was, which he surprisingly agreed with. The conversation was going s suspiciously well. He then explained some sort of supernova time travel complete nonsense plan he and Rami were discussing, which required the advanced warp core which the vessel has. The conversation went downhill rather quickly from there, arguing for a while he ended the call. Yarrow, I promise one day we'll have a decent conversation, or at least a neutral one. Felix sweetly called to inform me. Melloray and Coleus also figured out the whole blindness thing from the end Ember Twin fossil, and she thought this knowledge would help me out. Aw, thanks, dear. Hypothesis. Yarrow did not tell anyone I discovered it first. Boo. Ha ha. I hope he is alright. He seemed quite distressed by the end of our call. Okay, so... Datura does not get along with the other Nomai, it would seem. Since I can't get in the nor Northern Observatory, where does this go? The power station, naturally. This makes sense. I'm, I'm finding consistency. I have nowhere else to go but up, however. I'm hoping if I just stay still, this thing will catch me. It did not catch me. <laughs> Hello. I would like to come back down to the planet. Oh boy. Thank you developers for actually letting me see my legs. Oh, the trees work on this side. That's good. Where are we? Anglerfish hunting blind. That's where we were. Campfire. Oh, there's a Hearthian that came here. Entry number who cares crashes to boring crashes zero. Sounds like a Feldspar log. Well, dark bramble, here I am. Saw what I thought were two crashed ships over there, but sort of looks intentional. One looks Nomayan, but the other one, I've got no clue. Had to wander around using the walkways, quite peaceful, ignoring the dark brambliness of it all. Some places couldn't get into, I have some ideas. So if anyone's listening to this and wants some help, come chat with me. After I return, that is, well, unless you're as mad as I am. They want to come find me inside Dark Bramble. Anyway, off or off inside I go to adventure. To adventure, they say. Here's a know my house. Wild Spar, you seem to have an idea of how to get inside the Northern Observatory. Dark Bramble, kind of cool, kind of spooky. 
Nothing edible here. Brought some supplies. I still be good for water, but these brambles, I imagine, are only useful as a building material. It does have anglerfish in it, doesn't it? Not sure what I'm supposed to do with the shuttle. I guess I'll make camp here now. Actually quite nice in this air pocket anyway. Weird trees. Yeah, I know your intentions are good, but maybe it's time to give up on this obsession with the eye. You know, the whole letting go thing. Everyone goes on about. I'm learning a lot this second loop. Jetpacking around the planet is quite fun. I should keep a couple eyes on my fuel, though. Had a dream of bridges connecting up all the ice on the islands. They were burning, and I was burning. But if I stay here a while, a non burning variant could be useful. What do you mean, burning? Uh, this planet reminds me of when I went with Felix Gusty Gardens. Oh yeah, and the Cosmic Cave. Those those were good times. And here I am on Dark Bramble alone. Have to focus him on a mission. Here lies my first house. Murdered by Giants Deep. I'm sorry? First house murdered by Giants Deep? We're not on a collision course, though. I don't get it. Weird structures. More word walls. Right. The shuttle is just sitting here. And I can't send it back without sending me back. So, I'm going to smash it to bits. It'll be symbolic. You know what to say. I will not return until I have accomplished what I set out to do. Which was... So I did it, I suppose. I used this smashy, smashy device on the shuttle, which dented it. And sent off the shuttle's alarm, which was, well, alarming. And the warp core fell out, so I went over to grab it. Might be useful, I thought, but after returning to the shelter here to use the device a second time, the shuttle blew up. Mission accomplished, but also, wow, I almost died. Should be more careful. Alright, we learned smashy smash. Shuttle blew up. Update again. Set up projection pool in the ice island west of here so I can talk to Felix and my daughter. I have a daughter. But instead, Bells and Pi called, informing me the gravity cannons were improved a bit since I left. They too realized the issues of my shuttle being stuck here. Told me that they were trying to recall it from the gravity cannon, but the switch they added wasn't working for some reason. They told me to check if there was something up with my shuttle. Haha. <laughs> Oops. Oops, indeed. What have we here? Oh, it's the smashy smashy! And that's what remains of the shuttle. It would, it would seem... Friend enjoys some symbolism, too. Who is the friend? Time to destroy another ship. Use the machine just once, which damaged their ship and caused the alarm to go off. Remembering last time, I waited. Friend was a bit confused why I wasn't using the device again, but I sure I knew what I was doing. We waited and waited, and then bang. When the ship exploded, too, they then understood. Friend used to go off to their clan occasionally. Perhaps building a house here made it so they don't need to. Anyway, I'm glad you're here, friend. Friend asked why I've written and am writing my thoughts and leaving them around the place. I told them it's kind of a nomai thing. Nomai are or are supposed to be nomads, so I suppose it's a way of telling other nomai clans, haha, we were here first. 
or warn them of dangers or cool stuff or something. Okay. I want to see what happens if I crush the scout. Nothing. Okay, so this looks like what remains of the friend's ship. And that's the Nomai shuttle. Oh, these custom textures and meshes. Oh. Hey, little one. You'll be off to school on Brittle Hollow soon. No railings above a black hole. I imagine you'll be glad to get away from all this sand, huh? 24 entries. Oh, Solanum! Yeah, but I don't like that Mom is going to be the teacher. Sometimes I wonder if Felix is intentionally doing this to you. Hypothesis. Much embarrassment awaits you. No, I... I just remembered. I wanted to ask you something. The eye, was it? I keep hearing about it. All right, we'll see. Felix detected a signal on the vessel, a uh, signal from something older than the universe. Spooky. Uh, we can't seem to find the signal anymore, so I mean, that's it, really. The vessel. That was the other thing. What happened to the vessel? Oh, darling, that's not a happy story. Another time, maybe. Oh, but I'm curious. You're curious, are you? Oh, all right, but don't tell your mother. I didn't warn you. So, Datura... Datura is Solanum's father? And Felix is Solanum's mother? Maybe? So I suppose I'll tell it from my perspective. Ahem, I was a member crew of the vessel, a moon-sized spaceship capable of warping anywhere. I was reading in the library when suddenly we warp, but on our arrival there was a horrible screeching sound. We had crashed. I try to look for your mother, but I am forced onto an escape pod. I landed on Ember Twin, and Felix landed on Brittle Hollow. Both groups had to rebuild to survive. Many years passed until finally a shuttle was sent from Brittle Hollow, and we were reunited. Us on Ember Twin were then told why we crashed, and about the eye after that failed efforts. To find the eye began. Did everyone get to an escape pod? Not quite everyone. Only three of the five pods were launched. What happened to the th third one? It never got out of Dark Bramble. Are they alright? Maybe. We haven't been able to contact them yet. If they're still all alright. Oh. Well, I did warn you. What are you two talking about? Dad told me about everyone, about how everyone died on the vessel. Solanum, I did not say that. Solanum, you're so smart. Okay, and then this is friend's ship. And I see no thingy on it to explore. That's another piece of it. Okay, I... Let's see, I could try to find Feldspar, but my ship is stuck. So I think what I might do is just wander around the ice and follow the walkways. Get as much information as I can in this loop. There's giant steep. I still don't understand how the power station could get flooded by it. We. It's all falling apart? 
It's all falling apart. Where is it all going? The entirety of the structure. This is what they mean by going to Giant Steep. Oh, what a cool angle. I've never seen Giant Steep eclipse the sun like this before. Can I get my ship back? I guess I can understand now how the anglerfish and jellyfish can like switch planets from giant steep to uh Okay, this is a very cool effect. I don't know if I could use it to like discover anything considering I only have like 30 seconds after uh, everything falls off of Dark Bramble. And lands on Giant Steep. Uh, but I, I love that effect. The gravity pulls everything from one planet to another, just like the, uh, the Hourglass Twins. So yeah. Another reason to utilize the time loop in a brilliant way. Where it's it's not it's not it's not just that the sun explodes every 22 minutes. It's like I only have 22 minutes to explore as much as I can of the new stuff on this planet before it all falls into the ocean. This is brilliant. All right, let's find out what we've learned. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. Okay, so South Pole Shelter. Um, I don't think I got too far there. The Hunting Blind. I learned some stuff there. All right. Um, the initial campsite. Okay, there's something about a friend. And then Feldspar, of course. Yep, the shuttle crusher, projection pool, the island west of his landing site to be able to talk to his wife and daughter. And there's a way into the Northern Observatory. Okay, oh. Gotta find Feldspar signal. Ah, third try. Third try. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. I know there's a bunch more stuff to discover on the ice. Um, and I probably should be doing that, but I'm also going to crash and die. <laughs> Almost crashed and died. No, go back. It's like autopilot aborted. This one was the the crusher place. Yep, so this one was the crusher place. And then I 
went over to this one next, and that's when everything fell into the ocean planet. Yeah, I think so. Land. Another happy landing. Yeah, it's perfect. We got some strange markings on this. Ghost matter detected. Cool. I recognize these symbols before. Okay. Yeah, rather than reach Feldspar, I'm going to, uh... What is this? Friend's house. Okay, I remember these uh, symbols before. Friend's house, other entrance. Map of Dark Bramble. Here's a little model. Yep. No, my staff. Looks like logs. You know, I was kind of daunted by all these scrolls. Okay, so the ghost matter is up the stairs. But not fully in the stairs. And this is where cutting the power comes into effect. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> uh, utilizing both Nomai and Stranger Technologies. Uh, it is very evident to me at this point in the mod that the friend is one of the people from the stranger. Why one of them would be so curious as to leave the stranger is beyond me. Yep, there's that. They have a sleeping bag and a scroll. Observation chair. Okay, I gotta I gotta figure out how to read this quick. We got a museum. Okay, there's a lot of information in here, but I wanna read the scroll first. Yes, I have the universe. Yes, yes, places to read read stuff. Perfect. Okay, the eye on first discovery, all was known to it, was old, older than the universe, similar to Nomai, us curious beings made a big sacrifice to reach it. During the journey, a big theory on our vessel, as Datura would say, was the eye created this universe. Suppose this was not the first time, hypothesis, could the eye create the universe again every time it dies. Once we arrived at the eye, one saw a vision of it destroying the universe after one interacts with it. Most were horrified and de devastated. Their new purpose became hiding the eye away to protect our universe. My other friend and I did not believe the eye was to be feared. We still believe it is a creator. Suppose the vision was misinterpreted, or wrong, or unfinished? Uh, the others have been burnt on the inside and did not wish to be burnt again, so they ignored us and told us to move on and stop holding on to the past. Uh, I know it is in my heart the eye is good. I believe there is more to the story than they wish to know. 
Oh, they have a new interpretation of it. Little butterflies coming out. And rain or blood? Blood and butterflies. Blood, butterflies, a severed head, a fox, and the cheese to die for. That was an Oblivion reference. Art house. Got some new music here. We got uh, the solar system. Bramble. Is this a remix of the museum theme? Yep, the stranger in the river. This is home, says friend. <gasps> He's learning how to speak Nomai. Feeling lost, I did not finish it. This is good enough. Curious system here. More curious beings wish others were not decayed and could meet you. What? I wish others were not decayed and could meet you? What, what do you mean? <laughs> A little anime of uh, Brittle Hollow versus Giant's Deep. This thing we have going is going quite well, I think. I teach friend the know my language so we can talk to each other, and they teach me art, as it appears to be very important to their species. Though judging by my painting here, I have a lot to learn. Talking is hard for me same, not only you learning. Does one have a lot to learn, or does another have a lot to teach? What? <laughs> what? Look at that! It's so cute! I want to take a screenshot. Oh, it's so cool! Anything behind the paintings? Oh, they're paint buckets. Gotcha. This is so cool. I think there's another scroll for me to find somewhere. Oh, yeah. The scroll is likely inside there. And then if I turn off the lights, I should be able to get into the other side, like the other half of the house. This little box in the bottom. Oh boy. I hope I have enough time to find out. We'll find Feldspar next, but like the relationship between the stranger and the Nomai. I did kind of like ask myself when playing the the Echoes of the Eye DLC, like, did the Nomai have any interaction with them? Like, did they have some sort of, like, invisibility detector, or was there any effort for the strangers, or the owl, elk people, the Alks, to, like, find the Nomai? Of course, they were all probably asleep at that time, except for few exceptions. Yeah. So if I turn off power to this area, everything should become dark. Okay. And then, whoop. And then I should launch, relaunch the scout in there. I return, that one door should be open. Because if I know how the stranger technology works, it's light based. No, my technology may be teleportation based. But yeah, now that I've cut power to the village. Goodness, I, I think I missed an entire building. <laughs> 
I got so excited. I got so excited to return to this place. Being dark down here. Yep, it's open. It's open. Hello. We got a scroll. We got a projector. An invisible bridge going from the dead jellyfish somewhere. Uh huh. This is bad stuff. No, th this is the okay stuff. Okay, let's go read the scroll and then do the last building. Friend and I have been discussing the eye to try to figure out its deal. So it is older than the universe, and someone from Friend's clan had a vision showing it would destroy the universe if anyone touched it or whatever. But one has to wonder how this universe was created then. If the eye destroyed the previous universe, perhaps it also created this one. Yarrow and the others believe the eye is quantum, so if that's true, I suppose it would be fitting for the eye to be in a superposition of both good and bad. Yes? But does this not mean that blocking the eye signal is wrong? That is difficult to answer. You wouldn't want the location of the universe reset button being blasted for all to hear, would you? We cannot keep it locked away either because we are afraid to die, so... I'm not afraid to die. Death is just an extremely uninteresting to me. This universe isn't over yet, so let's not be afraid to live now, friend. Okay. Whoop. Okay. I did cut power to this building, so hopefully it's not... Uh, Okay, looks like I can go up until that point. Record this hypothesis. I'll need to listen back to this so you're still looking for the eye. Please, I really don't want any arguments. Hey, don't walk away. We've been stuck here for so long, Felix and I have a child now. This is no place to grow up. So, Solanum grew up on Dark Bramble. We change our efforts to get out of here. Once we found the eye, we'll begin constructing a new vessel. Just, oh, come on, Yarrow. But we'd need a vessel to get to the eye anyway, so why not just build a vessel first? Then we could go back with the other clans. It would be nice not to be trapped. We're supposed to explore the universe. That's like our whole thing. I know, I know. It's just finding the Nomai, or finding the eye is very important to us. All the Nomai who lost their lives coming here. We must find the eye so they are not all lost over nothing. Right, I understand. Well, I figure, I'll figure a way out of here myself. And then I suppose I'll find the old vessel. How do you plan to do that? It's in Dark Bramble. I will go to Dark Bramble. What? Uh, Felix? You're the one who discovered the eye signal on the vessel, correct? Wow, it's an honor to meet you. Yarrow, is it? Clary told me of you. Do you mind standing over there? I need to speak with my partner. Oh, well, yeah. Just shout if you need me. Clary talked about me. Thank you, Totoro already been apart for so long. Oh, I see. Felix came back. is like, yeah. This hurts me just as much. But if no one else is finding a way out of here, do you want to come with me? I can't. I'm needed with search projects. 
Privet is my apprentice now. I'm a teacher at the new school district. What about Solanum? Our daughter. You can't expect me to do all this alone. You can, and I believe in you. <laughs> I need you to believe in me too. Please, I'll make one of these projection pools. It'll be like I'm still here. No, it won't. It'll be all, all right. Come here. Here's how it'll go. I'll set up a base on this planet. And I'll search for the vessel. And once I found it, I'll come back. You promise you'll come back? Of course I promise. And he never did. Okay. Quantum thingy. Another sleeping bag. Found quantum rock in ice. For you from friend. Yep, that's a quantum rock. Okay, I was kind of hoping I could go over there. Hmm. So it's just a wall. Yeah, it appears to be a wall of the bad stuff. If I just go over it, I should be able to not die from it. Aha! I'm a genius. Yes. We have survived. Oh, we found some... Oh no, I gotta read quick. I gotta read it quick. I heard some cracking. I'm hearing cracking. I'll say it, the eye is not my favorite fifth thing in the universe. This is why we're trapped in the star system, as we could be trapped in the Finding my own way out of here. To me, Yaro, Remy, and uh, wannabes. Attempting to make a discovery of... Come on, I'm not done yet, no! <laughs> no, I'm not done yet. No, come back, come back! Come back, I want to read. Read. <laughs> I want to read. <laughs> I want to read. No, where'd it go? Where'd it go? No, I wanted to read. I wanted to read. <laughs> oh no. Oh, I almost. Ah! <laughs> yes! Wait, I'm still alive? How did I survive that? How did I survive that? Let me read. Wait, wait, ah, it's, it's still there, it's still there. Do people believe the eye was good? I wrote off the, okay, what, what did, what am I learning from this? Destroys the entire universe while interacting with it. What are you saying? Help. Do you believe the signal blocker thing, friend says. Okay, I need to be not drowning. I need to be not drowning in order to read this. Also, I'm still alive. How am I still alive? How did I survive floating in a wooden shack from one planet to the next? That was fun.
that was really fun. More information every loop. Ah. Uh. This is a great mod. I'm I'm having so much fun right now. I honestly feel like I did when exploring the Echoes of the Eye. Like, you still know everything in the base universe, but, like, learning those couple more details that tie everything together, I'm, I'm getting the same feeling with this mod. Okay, so here's what we learned about Bramble Village. Okay, the friend is clearly... Whoop. The friend is friend is clearly um, a stranger. We went to the secret room and then there's a secret passage um, revealing a hidden path behind a jellyfish surrounded by ice. Okay, and that goes somewhere. But what I want to know I want to know Can you show me What I want to know is what that thing said about their realization about the eye of the universe destroying everything. I know what the eye of the universe does, but I want to know what they know about it. It's like something's very bright over there. It's the sun. I never thought it'd be the sun. <laughs> Let's find that village again. Okay. I want to say it's over here. This one, maybe? No. Wait. Yeah, that's it. This one is it. And hot. Okay, the power's back on. And then I know about the ghost matter in this room. Oh no, I missed. Why'd you go and put an obstacle in the middle of the ceiling? can go here. Fun little table. That's fine. Okay, I'm just gonna take this. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. We survived instant death. Okay. You were saying... I is not my favorite thing in the universe. It is why we are trapped in this star system and continue to be trapped thanks to my clan searching for it instead of finding a way out of here. To me, Yaro and Remy are Anoa wannabes attempting to make a discovery equivalent to his warp technology. Anoa invented warp technology. That's what I've learned today. All we know is that it's older than the universe. Believing it is anything good or worthwhile is pure speculation. Friend revealed to me a disturbing discovery about, or a disturbing discovery their clan made. The eye destroys the entire universe when interacting with it. Friend's other friend deeply believed the eye was good and wrote off this backstory uh, disabling their eye signal blocker thing. Unfortunately, it was react or fortunately it was reactivated and he says or and he was locked away in a vault or something. Friend says he had good intentions, but that brief the brief signal was released, Felix heard it. Eskal ordered the warp, and now we're all trapped here because of him. Good intentions aren't good enough. 
Sometimes I wish I could be like friend and Yarrow. Or be like friend and Yarrow and just be able to see the eye how they see it. Why am I the only one not interested in it? Is there something wrong with me? Okay. An interesting perspective. We don't need to repair landing gear. Okay, so there's something about that. There's also the projection pool. An island west of his landing site. Projection pool or hidden path? I'm thinking projection pool. I'm gonna find the shuttle crusher. West of the landing site. Where is west? Also, which one is the landing site? Hang on. If there's an achievement for this, I'm, go I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> I'm doing it. Shuttle Crusher. One, two, the circle is now complete. <laughs> there was no alarm. It just didn't do anything the first time. Just dunk. So good. Uh, okay. Let's see, west should be this way. I don't know if there's any uh, path over here, but we'll see. I know I haven't uh, discovered this tower yet. It was one of the things that stuck out. All right, land, please. Land, please. Land, please. Nope. Nah, 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 nah. What's that? <laughs> I couldn't land. Oh, it's part of my ship. Ow. Wow. That's pretty. Screenshot. Don't make me go back down. Don't make me go back down. I don't want to go back down. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. We made it. Okay, there's things in here to read. Okay, is this the landing site? I don't think it's the landing site. Looks like there was a walkway that got uh, removed. What are you writing on the floor? Potential disturbing discovery. Uh, have 
to confirm it in my observatory if it is what I think it is. Uh, no, surely it isn't. It's fine. Everything's fine. I should call my daughter. What did you find out? After crashing on Ember Twin, I saw something strange up in space. I kept it to myself. Too distracted. Uh, surviving, I suppose. Attempting to locate what I... What I saw... And hey, if I locate the eye, then we can all return to our living quarters prematurely. Update, I found it. There's a spherical region in space where the stars are occasionally flicker. As if some of those stars are fake. Okay, this is you finding the stranger. Okay, this is tying some stuff together. It appears we are not alone in the star system. Someone has just arrived here. It's nice to have company. I'm not sure how much we have in common, but I hope we can be friends. Update, it seems like they're staying for a while. I'll start building a house for them at the South Pole. Before my clan crashed here, I read another... About another... I had read about their species. If we could understand each other's languages, I'd love to hear their encounter with the... The Collector, from their perspective. What's the Collector? It's not a touchy subject, of course. They sat in the walkway. I sat with them, trying the, my best to comfort them. They're a, a happy person. Doesn't come. To, yeah, happy per, a happy person does not come to Dark Bramble. Okay. All right. So the walkway was smashed, but there might be a way. Conveniently, gravity is uh, less here. There is what appears to be things up there. My ship is gone. If I go outside, the gravity is less. Telescope. Why is gravity more on the inside? It's made out of wood. Actually, what what is this thing pointing at? Possibly uh, where the stranger is. Okay, so there's no way in. Except, uh, without gravity. Oh, that's convenient. Projection pool house. And this one goes to Bramble Village. Well, I just came from there. Let's go to the projection pool house. Actually, there's a, another bridge here. Oh, this also goes to the projection pool house. I have a feeling the projection pool house is in there. Let's keep exploring the surface here. the Northern Observatory. This goes somewhere, I think. There's a path leading up to it. Yep. A single wall of information. Failure of communication. Made worse by long duration. 
In our minds, meaning of words undergo mutation until we live in worlds of fabrication. I think that's just them... Yeah, that's just the, f the friend learning the language, I think. Okay. I'm gonna go over there. It may be time for me to go, uh... See Feldspar. Or jump in that hole. My time is running out. Okay, I'm gonna go on top of this one, and if I don't see anything... There's a label here. There's a label here! This is me trying to read the label. does this say? Study tower and projection pool house. Well, we just went to the study tower. Couldn't get inside it. There's another way inside the thing. This, will, this has information. Initial campsite and shuttle crusher. Not we, not we, not we. It's fine. <laughs> I'm learning so much. Ugh. I want to give a huge thanks to the Outer Wilds modding community for constantly injecting new life into this game for all the people that can't play it a second time, which is everybody. <gasps> like, the joy you feel with exploration and discovery in this universe. It, it's, it's everything I could have hoped it would be. Right, learning some stuff, learning some stuff. Okay, so we learned uh, there's a, a tower, the top of the tower, we gotta figure out how to go up there. Stairs have collapsed, wall with no my text inside the window, missing projection pool, structure next to the study tower appears to have broken off and fallen into the planet somewhere. Yes, uh, Northern Observatory, Saw something that disturbed him, but he had to go on to his observatory to confirm it. Something called the Collector, but didn't elaborate. Okay, hidden path, top of the tower, missing projection pool, Collector, observatory. All right, it's time to find Feldspar. on my third try last time. Come on. Almost. Sorry, dude. Perfect. Duplicate signal. Here we go. Okay, I'm just gonna leave autopilot on. Um, dark bramble, dark bramble, dark bramble. No, my grave. I want to find. Not the vessel.
I don't know what that was, but if I had to guess, it was a meteor from Brittle Hollow. I have no idea what that was. Insta-death in this game is just something I've accepted at this point. Okay, so before I take off this time... Okay, we are going to... Do, 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 do. Feldspar's camp, um, find in rumor mode, that. That's where we're going. please on a clear course don't want any funny business who knows maybe on the way to Feldspar's camp I will accidentally find a missing thing no go in go in go in yes Yes! No! <laughs> it's, it's one of those moments where it, it plays back your memories and you just don't want to see the mistake you made. I just wanted to see my friend Feldspar. Okay, take three. Duplicate signal, I wonder why. Autopilot engaged. Am I going to hit the sun? Yes, I'm going to hit the sun. I'm smarter than that. I know better than to trust the sun. to moons here. Okay. Good enough. Alright. We're gonna go in. And we're going to aim full speed ahead and kill engines. Now. I believe there are anglers here. So my question is, how do we get to Feldspar's camp with the beastie in the way? Wow. How sad would it be if, like, I just went straight into its mouth? further away from it. I just need to be outside of chase distance. I 
I mean, there is another way to get there. I just don't like the fact that I have to go towards it. To get to Feldspar's camp. Just hug along the back wall. Okay, here we go. Oh man, there's so many of them here. Why are there three? There's never been three before. That's a thing. That's a dude. And that's a dude. Go in. Go in. These seeds are just a nuisance sometimes. There we go. Okay, multiple markers there. Multiple markers there. Right, it seems to be safe in here, but I don't want to chance it. So what I think I'll do... That's the one. <laughs> look, look at all the duplicates. Feldspar, why do you have so many signals? Bar, buddy. Can I, can I just squeeze in here a little bit? Yeah, good enough. Howdy, Fran. Hey, can I ask you something real quick? No time for grand heroic tales, huh? Um, let's see. Can you help me figure something out? Probably answers cryptically as usual, but sure. What is it? Northern Observatory has two security measures I can't get in. Two? Well, once you know what they are, then uh, you can get in. And how do I find that out? Yeah. <laughs> Explore, look around, ask someone else. Trying to get somewhere hard to reach. There's usually good stuff in hard to reach places. Help me figure something out. Uh, there's a painting in the village. I think is hiding a room behind it. No, I figured that one out. Uh, how do I get to the st top of the study tower? Stupor looking tall structure, isn't it? Yeah, stairs I've climbed. So you need to find something to get you up through the staircase, won't you? Yep. Thanks. Um, 
How might I find the projection pool house? The what? Oh, it fell in here, didn't it? You're not going to be finding it while wind randomly wandering around this place. So do what you did to find me. Though, I doubt... It's sending out a signal like I am, so that might be a problem. Hey, you're smart. You'll figure something out. Yep. Okay. Um. Something, something. There's a jellyfish here. Right. Feldspar was less than helpful. Study tower. Uh, this, the hidden path. So, this light right here. Excuse me. Okay, that's Feldspar's ship. Can I go in Feldspar's ship? Or is that just a... That's just a satellite, I think. Alright. I believe this is the way towards the frozen jellyfish thing. Somehow got us to Giant's Deep. Or not. Yeah. Entry number, I'm not gonna say one. Crashes three. Okay, that one I've already seen before. I believe you're able to crawl inside it. Yeah, do not eat this even if you're dying. Okay, so there's a path over here. And it showed being able to walk on it. Or at least where the path was. But uh, I don't want to chance it. Because I'm not in the dream world. So I'm going to go ahead and... Trust in my jetpack. This is so cool. So much suspense. This is a structure. Structure! No, don't fall off. <laughs> okay. I'm back. The others left. Can you hear me? I'm going to leave a recording here for you. I'm really sorry. I shouldn't have come here. This is your secret room, and I should have respected that. Friend, are you there? At least knock on the door so I know. Nothing. Maybe they're asleep. Look at the metal door and cage. They really don't want me getting in in there again. Duh. I can't chop my way in unless... Oh, stupid metal. I need like a explosion or something to blast the stupid door down. How would one make an explosion? A safe one. If there was even such a thing. Stupid curiosity. Ironic, is it not? Whoops, forgot to start, stop recording. So, an explosion... An explosion would open the door. Well, I mean, I found this area. And it appears to also be... Whoop. 
I am falling inside. Okay. Maybe I'll get back to my ship. Maybe not. Oh no. Yeah, it was this one. There's got to be some sort of self-destruct button on the ship. Once I get back, I can actually like get rid of all these markers. My plan is to crash the ship into the door. And maybe, just maybe, the hypothesis will be complete. If not, then I have to wait for the supernova, which would be really dumb of me, because then I'd have to, like, explore the entirety of that secret area in the time it takes for the supernova to reach the area in which I was sitting on, if that makes any sense. It doesn't to me. Okay, I gotta get out of here. Turn around. Yep. Yeah, here, here's, here's the way out. That is a way out. This is a bigger way out. Electrical systems damaged. Looks like power's okay to me. What's on the top of the ship? By top, it could have meant bottom. find pretty much any way out. I guess I just fly in any any which direction. I was told finding the seed pod in which you came in is the way to get out. But I can't find that. Because I only find feldspars. Infinite. Dark Bramble is infinite. Wait, that could be the way in. It's dark. It's a big tunnel. Ah. Okay, now I have to do is just 180 my way back in there. that was. Okay. Go back in. But we also go right back out. I can't believe that didn't work. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. I'm gonna outrun you. Aha! I'm pretty 
pretty sure that the vessel's over here. Okay, we're gonna go back in this way. This should take us outside. Nope, I was wrong. Oh man, everything's broken. If I could just find a way out of here. I can outrun an angler fish, can't I? Yes I can, yes I can. I don't want to go to this one. I've already been to that one. Please don't be a beastie. I read something about one of these being the way out. figure it out. I'm just gonna read about it. I thought going back through the one you came in was the way out of Dark Bramble. Death, death is another way out. It probably would have taken me the entire loop just to figure out how do I get out of here? Okay, let's find out what's in the secret area by blowing up our ship. Yep. So we learned, uh, if I want to return here, I should use the mark location. Yeah. Sealed entrance. It appears to be sealed. Detura theorized that only an explosion could create an opening. Well, let's make an explosion. Secluded structure. see a self-destruct anywhere. So we're going to have to figure out how to make the ship blow up. Idea because it said you gotta wait like a really long time after hearing the beeping. We got our waypoint measured out. If this works, I'm gonna be so happy. I just need to get to the ship crusher. We're gonna line ourselves up ever so nicely. this. Like this, please. Yes, just like this. Perfect. Okay. Refuel, reoxygenize to the observatory. Okay, we go like this. Yep. We're beeping. We're beeping. Time. Give me enough time. Give me enough time. Abandon ship. 
Abandon ship. Abandon ship. No, no, no. I figured it out. No. I figured it out. <laughs> no, that was supposed to work. I was still too close to it. How do I get clear of the blast radius? Attempt number two. Uh, you know, I was wondering, like, why the ship crusher exists. Like, why is it symbolic to destroy your ship? And now it's, like, integral to the story of the mod? Uh, I, I love that so much. It's not just the feeling where everything clicks and starts coming together, but it's like that one piece of information that didn't make sense to you before now is like essential and just like, oh, I was like, yeah, that's fun. You can crush your ship. That's fun. <laughs> and I even did it a little bit ago where I was just like, yeah, that's fun. I just crushed my ship in solidarity with all them. Yeah, now we're all th all three of us are stranded on this on this planet. It, it, it was fun. And now <laughs> and now it's necessary. Okay, let's find our ship crusher again. Here it is. This is fine. Come back, please. Come back, please. Too fast. It's just a weird shaped box. And all of a sudden. <laughs> eh. Yeah. It, it, it's just a weird shaped box. Perfect. Yep, the alarm went off and all that good stuff. Here we go. I don't want to go too fast. Did I? Oh, I overshot it. time. I need more time. Abandon ship. Open the hatch. Abandon ship. Run. Okay, this was too far away, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, like, back off a little bit. Yes! Yes. Yes. I blew it up. <sighs> Sorry, ship. Okay, so the, the stranger dude... He... He died. He went... He went back into his, um... His dream world. He is in the dream world. You're still alive. Goodbye, friends. So be my, t so be my home for a little while. It seems. Oh, Dotora, Dotora, getting yourself into always. Ha ha. Hope he knows I'm not mad at him. My friends are just attempting to appease our decayed elders who have decided this. I should get to sleep. They will all be waiting for me. Hypothesis, I will see you again, Datura. Worry not. No audio detected for 10 minutes. Stopping recording. So 
You got yourself a little uh, happy place right here. Do you have a second artifact for me? Okay, recording now. I'm keeping quiet because some friends are here talking with friend. So I need to process what's just went for. I was curious, friend, where friend disappears off to sometimes, and it led me here. There's no door, so I walked in. At first, it was merely a nice, quiet place for them to hang out, and get some alone time. But I picked some, picked up a weird lantern resembling object from the ground before tripping on the metal large I suppose I got knocked unconscious woke up and s or started dreaming almost immediately in friend's house but it wasn't friend's house it was a copy some other planet a ringed planet with an unsetting sky it weirded me out so I exited and walked across a bridge to another building where there were a lot of friend's elders upon seeing me they were surprised startled but not hostile at least Still, I attempted to remain out of their way. I decided to wander around the planet before the night fell. I took a raft to an area where buildings surrounding a giant hole went over to have a look at it, but suddenly red lights began flashing. On a balcony, I saw one of friend's kind cover their ears before yelling out and disappearing into thin air. I don't know what I did, but I definitely did something wrong, and the rest immediately began hunting me down. Panicking, I was able to escape by taking a raft to a hidden old burned structure to hide in. I sat down, closed my eyes, and waited. A while later, a friend wakes me up. I hugged them tightly, wanted to tell them I'm sorry, but looking over, I see friends still alive. Friends? What they meant by that? I'm just worried I did something really bad. Didn't intend to. I hope I can tell friend. Uh, that's what he meant for you. Oh, one of them is approaching me. Hello. There. Is that a projection? Nothing. Oh, what? You're gonna lock them away? Is that your solution for everything? Or something? Hey, let go of me. Friend, I... How is this on the real world? So I know, I know this. This makes sense. This doesn't. This recording was taken in place or in the dream world. Now I have no ship. Uh -huh. I have no ship. Solanum. Not Solanum, but Datura made it to the thingy. Or to the dream world. My question is do I go to the dream world? And then, uh, what about the other. Abandoned place. And the way on top of the observation tower. I don't think I need to turn off power to every place. In order to get there, you know? this. Oh, <laughs> there's a bridge. I thought it was a, like a giant looming tower. Okay, so another way inside the Happyville structure. Ow. Another way inside. And yes, I called it Happyville. I should find one of those broken bridges and then just jop or drop myself into the hole below. I'm pretty sure it's that one. Uh, 
no. It's not. It's not that one. It's, uh, over there. It's like... Yeah, that one. Wee. Nice gentle landing, please. Nope. But yeah, this is the one I want to go into. This one right here. Please and thank you. Please. Please. Fuel level critical. I'm just gonna meditate into the next loop. I don't have the fuel to just circle around a bottomless pit. Okay, so then Dotura learned about the dream world. And Dotura's friend uh, is now in a memory lounger on Dark Bramble. But who is the collector? Let's read. Turo was curious about the friend. He found an artifact in Greenfire, tripped, knocked himself out, awakened to a different planet. Came across the elders. Accidentally rang an alarm bell, which woke one up. Woken by a friend, some others having arrived in Dark Bramble. Separated them from each other, containing friend by sealing the entrance. Oh, friend was trapped in the thing. Green fire. Holding an artifact next to a green fire. Uh huh. Okay, top of the tower, the collector, missing projection pool. So I should try to find this, or I could go to the stranger pick up an artifact, travel back here, blow up the ship, do that thing, and discover his side of the green fire. And that sounds like a very fun thing to do. Where's my stranger stuff? This. Um, who has... Where is the... Not the Forbidden Archive. I want to find... The blown out... Observatory. This. Damage laboratory. I don't want to go to the sun. Alright, I'm going to stare at the sun as I travel across the universe. Yeah, you stay there. Yes, I know everything is revolving around you. Because you're the sun. That's the one exception. The universe... Or the solar system does revolve around you, sun. You are, you are that important. Perfect. I'm just going to land here. be really careful not to damage the ship because when we set the alarms off stay yoink Oh no. 
I, ju I just wanted to. Yeah. Hear that. Hear that. It was like three things that were broken. What did I do? Headlamp, that's not that important. Is it? Okay, did I fix everything? Oxygen tank damaged. good I don't see anything else damaged upper hull see I don't want to go into the ship crusher and instantly destroy okay yeah I don't want to instantly destroy the ship We want to find this again. All right. Setting a course outside of the stranger. Back to Dark Bramble. Hopefully not back into the sun. I hear the music in the background. It's playing uh, the river theme. It's getting louder. This is a remix of it. can't be the end of the mod. I don't know what I expect to find there. <laughs> this can't be it. This is like the only thing I figured out how to do. <laughs> This is a really nice remix. And therefore, this counts as a review. I, I haven't heard this before. Did the mod author actually make this remix of this, uh, this song? Ship crush, got the artifact. Don't bump into anything else. Slow, slow and steady, slow and steady. This is fine. We're gonna be okay. We're gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. I'm very scared. It's gonna be okay. Music stopped. Okay. <sighs> now we can doze off. This is fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Now we're back inside their house. It's the dream world. One thing I gotta be careful is I don't know if any of the strangers outside oh he's got like a private he's 
got like a private entry or a residence over here. Okay, I'm gonna keep this off as much as possible because I don't know if there's gonna be a dude. Yeah, his his flame was still on. I might find him. Yep. I found him. Please don't kill me like everyone else did. Hi. Hi, friend. Are you friend? You're doing the same thing? Oh, you have Solanum's animation set. Datura, prisoner, friend, explain. Me. Hi, this is me. Me. Um, explain. Oh, you learned how to do no my. You are in my home star system, a simulation of it. Make yourself at home and stay for as long as you'd like. I would avoid the others, however. I'm curious, how are you here? Are you from outside the star system, or are you from elsewhere like us? Um, this was built... This, this was built for one to be a while as we searched for a new home. However, over time, more and more of us, our elders, decayed and irreversibly into the simulation. Very few of us left alive outside. Mostly the youngest when the Nomai arrived. After our decayed elders suggested we silently observe the Nomai to ensure the eye was not found. Right. Um, Datura. Tell me about Datura. You explain him to me. He was a good friend to me, but not always to his clan or to himself. A long time has passed since I was with him on Dark Bramble, however, this might seem strange. It still feels recent somehow. You can only make so many unique memories here. After a long while, the days and months and thousands of years all blend together. Hardly wishes he has escaped the star system, but I know that is impo improbable. If I take explain and I move this, is this compatible? Am I going to get new stuff here? Have you been exploring our structures on the surface of Dark Bramble? Have you found Datura or his body? When he wasn't searching around inside Dark Bramble, he was usually in his study tower or observatory I helped build. The planet used to be whole. Can you imagine our vessel? We did not notice it until it broke a while after that. Oh, and as a security measure, I remember that an overly curious young Nomai occasionally visit him. I wonder why Solanum never visited. Anyway, Use my quantum shard gift to affect the observatory's door. So to enter, you must not be looking at the door. Ah. So to enter the observatory door, you must not be looking at the door. Hypothesize the eye signal bounced around in Dark Bramble before reaching the Nomai, which is why they warped there instead. Aha! 
Um, prisoner. I've met him. I feel like I should be more excited. You might be able to free my friend. In one way or another, I know he is no longer with us. Explain the prisoner. A friend of mine let out the eye signal. Yep, know that. Long time passed. When the Nomai arrived, all of our elders had decayed into this simulation. Just the young of us left alive outside. Yep. Hearing of the Nomai's arrival, our decayed elders burned the remaining archived codes for our prisoner's fault. I had planned to free him. The others outside wanted to help. You're not all monsters. I hope you can believe, but we discovered there's nothing we could do now. The controls raising our prisoner's submerged structure from our vessel's water were destroyed by one of our elders at some point. Raising it outside also raises the simulated version of the structure allowing access to the underground within this simulation and letting our prisoner leave and join the rest of the, de the decayed when freed. So even if we freed him from his vault, he would still be trapped underground, and so I never saw him again. I try not to think of what he has gone through. It's not easy for me to say, but I hope he has. I hope he is, is no longer alive. The alternatives seem much worse. Well, what about you? Um, tell me about yourself. Hello there, my name is Friend. That is what Dakura called me before I understood his language. The simulation is now our home. We are all spooky ghosts. <laughs> we are all spooky ghosts. We're all spooky ghosts. The elders decayed willingly, but the youngest died mysteriously and simultaneously. Wish we could understand your language. What happened? Did something happen to the Nomai too? When Datura explained to me what friend meant, he asked for my real name. I told him friend was fine. My old name never fit me anyway, I felt. Traveled here in search of the eye of the universe, and I never wish we discovered it. The eye has only burnt us. Okay, and now, uh. Me and you, we do stuff. Hello there, you are a curious being. It's nice to meet you. Long has passed since anyone new has come here. I'm glad that translator device uh, of yours made it over. Oh yeah, why do I have the translator and not my suit? Uh, the simulation is strange with what it decides to bring over. Perhaps all my nomai, nomai writing made the simulator simulation recognize the device? I don't think so, but like, you know, it, it is what, you, what it is, you know. Tell me about your relationship with Dutura. We met for similar but opposite reasons. After my other friend was imprisoned, I felt very burnt inside and I ran. Fortunately, Dutura was quite welcoming. Sometimes I wish we'd ran away, us together, into the galaxy, but it was only a thought. Our opposing views on the eyes, surprisingly not an issue. Between us, hypothesis, the true, true issues were with something else. So I've been quite disappointed to hear our vessel was not able to travel intergalactically. Not one, or not the escape pod he was looking for. Uh -huh. I think I did all the options. You, friend, prisoner, me... You and the prisoner? One, we 
we call our prisoner used to be my friend. He would tell me how he wished to set the wrongs the elders right by releasing the eye signal. I didn't realize he was serious. I miss him. Okay. Uh, we talked about Detoro, we talked about me and him. Uh, oh yeah, tell me about the prisoner and Detoro. This could be important. Is Detoro, like, actively trying to free the prisoner too? No, not like the sound of our prisoner. Seeing how he released the IC signal d despite hearing of the vision by uh, destroying it. One thing they have in common is becoming big fluffy bundles of anger due to the eye. The Torah did not much care for the eye a while away from his clan, built up anger towards them, had a big falling out with Yarrow. Prisoner believed with unbreakable confidence that the eye was pure good seeing the others hide it away. He viewed them as fearful, evil, and idiotic. Him and I told them we are not afraid of the eye, but suppose it is easy to call others afraid. Say so they are not able to accept the truth despite you not knowing everything either. I think I did all combinations. That's the sound of the universe dying. Unless that's just the flood. I'm hoping it's just the flood. Your friend, me, friend, explain. Oh no, push off. Help! Oh, th yeah, this is the end of the universe. Goodbye. Goodbye. There's no more gravity. Eh. Uh-oh. Where does this go? I don't have a flashlight. Oh, I need, I need the thing. just goes down to the, the surface and then we could continue with the rest of the DLC yeah I think so yeah that, that's the sound of the uh, universe ending Hey friend, did you know that the universe is ending? I don't know where you're looking. But this is it for us. Oh! A violent end. I thought it was just gonna end, you know, but... Oh, I suppose because... On the stranger, it moves clear of the supernova, and then it just ends. But the Dark Bramble one, everything flies on to Giant's Deep. Gotcha. Cool information, bruh. Sweet. So we found more about him. That's wonderful. But who's the collector? Cliffside home. Uh, so much stuff. Okay. So what I need to figure out is this. 
Those two are connected to the missing projection pool. I also have a theory about the the tower, the observation tower. Not the northern observatory, but the other structure. It said um, there that he helped build it. And if any stranger technology is used in there, I'm pretty sure, I'm fairly certain, that if I turn the lights off, something is going to change within that tower. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh... Yeah, yeah, right, right, right there. Where's the... That thing. I want to go towards that. <laughs> to the power station. Thank you. Alright, we got a... Uh cut power to the observatory. Goodness, there's still so much to do. I might not get it all done in three hours. This is fine. Okay, Bramble Power Station. Uh, which one is this one? Is this the Anglerfish Hunting Blind? Don't need to do that one yet, if at all. Bramble Village. Uh, is that the right one? Study tower and projection pool house. This is the projection pool house. This one again. Shuttle Crusher, no. Northern Observatory. Yeah, I guess I picked the right one. Alright. Turning power off. Power's off, will gravity work? Or did something else change in this area? What? Where, where did I bounce? <laughs> I wanted to land here. dark now. And the gravity's still high. Has that always been there? Check on surviving of the universe. Something flicker. Okay, I already read that one. This one. Yeah, we already read that one. Um, question though. Does this have a spot for those? 
quantum shards to just like move around because I could use I could possibly use quantum entanglement to get up there and for that I need to cut power to like everywhere so it's all dark yeah I don't see him here but if I take a look away If I'm not observing it, does a shard appear there? Let's find out. Cut the power to everything. do it? Did I just simultaneously turn off all power? You got you got to make doubly sure. I need to go to the village. Initial campsite. Ramble village. That one. Not the scout. So I know there's a shard. Side of the thing. So the door's quantum and you can't, or like reverse quantum or something, and you can't like go in while looking at the door. That makes sense. Okay, maybe I'll try walking backwards. Or maybe I'll find that quantum shard in the pitch black and just write it. Tura's house. Yes, the quantum shard. didn't work. <laughs> That's fine. There might be... I'm going to try my walk backwards into the observatory idea now. That is sure to work. 100% zero fail. Quantum door. Hmm. 
You know I could blast this door open too. Observatory. Top of the tower, the collector, northern observatory. So that didn't work. Pretty sure something to do with quantum entanglement would work. Um, in the meantime, let's jump off that broken bridge and go into the belly of the beast. This platform here. Ah, that's the circle. These two platforms here have apparently broken off into this. I'm gonna just hop inside here. We're gonna just sh shoot a scout. Okay, there's a fishy. Is it fishy? That's a thingy. Wait a minute. So launching the scout is not a silent action, I've learned. But I've also discovered how to find the signal of the sunken thingy, thingamajiggy. <gasps> okay. So I'm gonna go to the power station. I'm gonna throw a scout into the the projection pool, and then I'm gonna follow that signal. Uh, rumor mode. Cliffside home. Where's the power station? Hunting blind. Submerged structure. Study tower. This one. Power station. Please don't hurt. Please don't hurt me, son. Don't do it. Don't you dare. I'm watching you. I am watching you. Don't you dare. It's so cool that I can just like turn around. Uh, can I lock on to the... I should probably do retro rockets. I should really do retro rockets. Come on, lock on to the power station. This is such a cool mod. Another answer to the question, what if the Nomai and strangers interacted? Okay, I'm gonna leave the 
lights on for now. Another observatory. Okay. I still can't say nope. Study tower. This one. Wait, I'm gonna yeah, I said I'd leave the lights on, just shoot one in there. That's the one. Okay, scout. Show me the way. Hmm. I can't recall it. So I'm just going to pick one. Pick one and go. Oh, crap. Crap. Carp. No. <laughs> I, just, I just gotta pick one. Process of elimination. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. get there. Okay, now there's only two. It's never the closest one. But my gut feeling says go with the closest one. Okay, sent me back to the exact same place. So it's the further one. This is progress. Dark Bramble being... hang on. Hang on now. What a stroke of luck. Um, yep, that's an observatory. Let's see, you got a landing platform? Okay. Nope. Get back down there. Okay. What is this? Anglerfish. Oh, this is trying to find the vessel. Projection stones. Giant word wall. Okay, Riddle Hollow. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I, I know what to expect from here. It's directly into somebody's house. Okay, what did you learn from Riddle Hollow? Bells. Bells? Oh, yes, what is it? Wait. Let me just. Uh. Can I be picked up and brought to Brittle Hollow, like, now ish? Now? Bad timing for that. Pioneer pals are off in the Ember Twin shuttle, and your daughter recently went on her quantum pilgrimage. Already? We planned for us to meet at the Gravity Cannon when she returned. She seemed very eager to go as soon as possible. She even attempted to leave before she had visited the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. Perhaps she was eager to reunite? Hey, if you want, I can relay a message for you when she arrives at the North Pole. First timers are supposed to call me before going to the sixth location. Once they go, we lose communications. Yes, please, tell her I hope she has fun and that I love her and that she, uh, should really take her time at the sixth location to take it all in, perhaps mention the shuttle situation so she knows there's no need to rush. All right. And, uh, 
afterwards, how quickly can you get a message to Felix? Uh, she's teaching at Brittle Hollow School, yes. Uh, so reasonably quickly, what's the message? Tell her I'm sorry for everything and we'll be together again soon. Okay, we'll do. And any other messages? Uh, uh, no, that's all. Thanks, pals. Be together again soon? Is she gonna die? Is she about to die? I mean, if Solanum's already on the quantum moon at this point, yes, this. The. The, uh, interloper's about to do something. Ash twin. Dad, where have you been? You haven't called for so long. We were so worried. What happened to you? Sorry, it's all. I've been going through some things, so your pilgrimage to the quantum moon is soon, right? Yeah. Are you excited? Well, it's just... Why are you still over there? You found the vessel. What? Well, that was your mission, wasn't it? So why haven't you come back? Did you... Do you just hate me? <laughs> Darling, no, of course not. The other Nomai, we don't really get along well, and I'm afraid of them and the things that they say to and about me when I return. They're not monsters, Dad. Are you sure it's the other Nomai you're afraid of, or is it just me, Felix, and Yarrow you're worried about? Because you have a lot more in common with the other Nomai than you think. I do. Time has cursed many... Nomai's passion for the eye search to deteriorate. Most of us wish to leave now, same as you. Wait, really? Yes. So, Dad, leave the place. There's going to be a vote soon to decide if we should continue to pursue the eye or if instead find a way out of the star system. Sun Station and Time Loop Plan have divided this plan and his, or clan and its failure has demotivated it. Hypothesis, we will leave the star system soon. So when's this happening? I just got one little thing to finish up here, then I'll be there. Uh, soon after my pilgrimage to the quantum moon, actually. I see. I'll be waiting for you at the gravity cannon when you return. So deter us at the gravity cannon. You tell me about your quantum moon trip. Sounds good. I thought you wouldn't care about the quantum moon. Eh, my problem is with the eye. The quantum moon is all right in my book. I see. I'll spare you the details. Well, see you then, Dad Chura. <laughs> Say hi to your imaginary friend for me. See you. Friend is their name, and they're not imaginary. See you, darling. Love you too, Dad. Aww. Is Datura on the gravity cannon? Error. Stone has been damaged. Some te some texts have been corrupted. Hello, Yarrow. Pfft. Oh, pfft. Uh, failure with the sun station. Psh, you are here to ridicule me. Hypothesis. Something would be beneficial to you if you if neither of you called each other anymore. Victoria, Yarrow, are you all right, Yarrow? Wait. See you later. Something worry will figure it out. I believe in us. So, Datura, what is the intent of your call? Uh, there's a, pfft, there's a, pfft, and it's. Pfft. So you observed pfft too, and you and me both. We actually pfft and pfft and pfft check. Pfft, pfft. Thanks anyway, Datura. Well, something. Gotta catch up to Yaro. See if feels all right. Don't be a stranger now. What is going on? Broken Ash Twin Projection Stone. If I use this, am I going to be okay? I want to see one, two, three masks. One of them is mine.
duplicate signal of my ship. Let's see what we learned here. Tried to leave, but both shuttles were not in use at the time. Um, ask bells. Tell us alarm, there's no rush. The damage stone Detroit called the others to warn them about something, but they already knew about it. They already knew about it. Two ways into the Northern Observatory. Two ways in. That's what we know. Yeah, I'm just gonna meditate. <sighs> I, I can't, for the life of me, remember how to get out of the inside of Dark Bramble. Okay. It's good information. I'll find closure inside the observatory. I already talked with friend. Um... Gravity cannon, right? He's in the gravity cannon. Or, or orbital probe cannon, right? I'm wondering if, like, that's just like a vanilla thing. Here again soon. Okay, the log doesn't mention anything about waiting for Solanum there. So maybe uh, finding Datura isn't uh, all that important. Okay, I'm actually going to mark the power station on the HUD. Because I think uh, cutting power to the Northern Observatory may assist in the quantumness of uh... yeah. If there's no light inside it, maybe I can like entangle my way inside. Fun little uh, thing to go find the friend. Northern Observatory. Yep. Right. Okay, I'm gonna keep the scout. Call the scout so it stops emitting light. I'll, I will. More than one way in. I can try blowing up the door. That didn't really work. Hmm. 
I'm not looking at it. Hmm. Okay, so looking at a picture of something quantum is the same as looking at the quantum thing. It doesn't look quantum. Okay, let's review some information. Two security measures keeping the door shut. I just realized something. Okay. I'm gonna track it. And then find some place to uh, bunker down. So I think I just discovered how to get to the top of the tower. This is some uh, Tower of Quantum Knowledge esque um, plays we're doing here. Alright. See, I thought because uh, the friend helped build it, it would be like a, uh, a lighting issue. Yeah, I thought it would be like a lighting thing. But no, it's not a lighting thing. It's a gravity thing, and if I know anything about Brittle Hollow, we gotta wait 14 minutes. So if I could find a campfire... I think it took me about a minute to get here. So I'm gonna wait about 12 minutes, maybe 11, just to be safe. So that way I can like be in the general area of the tower when we do the transfer to Dark Bramble. Whether or not I want to be inside the tower at the time um, we'll find out. Because I want to survive, but I also want to find out what's in it. And I don't want to lose it when the chaos of a gravity transfer between planets occurs. That is my thought process. So I'm probably going to do the waiting inside the tower. I wonder how much I'm capable of reading as the sun is exploding. Alright, that should be enough waiting. Ship. Here we go. I do have it marked on my map, which is nice. Okay, yep, 
it, 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 it. Stay, please. Thank you. Okay, we're, we're figuring things out. You know, I, here I was wondering why there's this whole thing about um, the entirety of the world, just like, or the entirety of all the structures here, sliding off the planet as um, as the sun explodes. Giant Steep is gaining on us. Scout launch. See, I'm pretty sure it's just gonna like start sliding. The gravity will go from 1.7 down to like zero, and then I'll be able to like just float on up there like it's nobody's business. so cool how you can track the planets as if they're like little versions of like is that the actual version of the planet can I see my ship here or is this just a model I think I see the ship yeah there's a little piece of the ship right there if it let me zoom in even further it probably would show me uh me as well Yeah, I don't want to leave, just in case. I see Quantum Moon. We're getting closer. The suspense is... Like I don't I don't want to mess up the timing of this is the thing. Okay, I hear things starting to shift. Okay, we're starting to move. Okay, the ship is gone. time. It's time. Oh boy. Oh no. Yes. Here we go. Need to get to the word wall. Conveniently placed gravity stone. Gimme. Lammy got in my observatory again. I know, I had a detector that locks the door if another ship other than ours is on Dark Bramble's surface. Unless you want to jump down from orbit, Lammy, I think I've won this one. So that's the secret. That's the secret way in. I can't land with a ship. That's how we get in. Wonderful. <laughs> that's all it took. That's the second... That's the second uh, piece of information. Brilliant. So all I have to do is stay in orbit. Oh, Lammy, sneaking into an observatory. That was a very important piece of information, but it took a super long time to get it. Alright. So what is this discovery? Yep. Okay, 
second security measure to the, the door will remain shut if another sh spaceship is on Dark Bramble's surface. I don't know how they define what a spaceship is, like a shuttle or what have you. Where is... Uh, Autopilot does not seem to be uh, that reliable. There. It's going to do it again. It almost did it again. Retro rockets after that collision. Okay. If another spaceship lands on Dark Bramble, I'm not gonna land on it. I'm gonna stay in orbit. We are going to just find. There it is. Now for the Zipper Turvy. Cool. So I'm going to go directly above it. I mean, this does imply that its default state of being. Oh man, that's really far away. I missed. I might have to go a little bit further in because I don't want to just... I just don't want to do a, a space drop. to do a space drop only to find that its default state is a closed door. However, if the door is quantum, ow, 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 I'm fine. Everything's fine. Okay, so the door's quantum, but I don't have a ship. Oh, come on. Did my ship land? Um, it might have landed. Yes, it did. My ship did land. Okay, I gotta figure out how to get to Dark Bramble without using a ship. Unless my ship is destroyed, maybe that would work. Like if I just crash land, would the door work?
Yeah, let's land on the power station. Because that's not technically the surface. Yep. So my thought is, if I land on the power station, then drop down from orbit, I should be fine. Watch the sun get super close as we pass by. Feel that heat. Completely calculated. Not even close. Stay in orbit. Not going to touch the surface at all. I don't know how it's detected. If I get a certain distance away or what. Observatory. Yep. I'm going to cut power to it because quantum. And quantum works better in the dark. Hello, interloper. Now I just have to. Uh... Oh. I was like, find the planet. some ice. Okay, down, 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 down. Perfect landing. The Northern Observatory should be on the North Pole. I see it. Okay, my ship is definitely not on the surface this time. I think the walkways definitely help in navigating it. It reminds me of uh, that one modded Halo Combat Evolved map where it's, I think it's called uh, Yo Yo Rast Island, where uh, like, the bases are right next to each other, but there's a huge divider. So you have to, like, do this huge obstacle course through, of like, nonsensical paths and the like. Just to get to the other side. Super fun for capture the flag. Okay. I don't have a ship. I've dropped from orbit. It's dark in there. Thank goodness. It worked! Quantum shard technology in the door. Yay! <laughs> and I think having it dark in here helped, because if I didn't have it dark in here... Okay, gravity inside is pretty strong. Okay. 
Okay. Let's see what, see what we have to uh, learn here. Oh boy, what's this? Is this your newest painting? Pretty. This is the Collector, is it not? Yes, indeed. I was hoping you would recognize it. How do you know of it? That is quite curious. Well, it was big intergalactic news. Bramble planets like this one are somewhat known, but this was a mysterious threat. Magnitudes larger. That many desired to know the cause of to prevent potential future tragedies. I see. Was it ever discovered... Uh, where the Collector came from, or how it formed then? I'm not sure, or I'm not that I'm aware of, but I wanted to ask you, what was it like from your perspective when the c Collector arrived? When I was a young child, I noticed strange f feelings uh, spreading in the faces of the elders as if they had knowledge they wished to hide from me and the others. Some things never change, I suppose. Uh, sorry, please continue. So my other friend got his parent to explain. It was a planet on the other side of the galaxy. A bad planet. It had begun evaporating and moving towards us, releasing a deadly substance like a toxic gas as it drifted through it. At the time, my species were pre-interstellar and unable to combat the threat, set out a distress signal with fragmented hope that somebody out there would help. But the planet drew near as it threatened to destroy us and all life in the galaxy. And then their distress signal was heard by a wandering Nomai vessel, correct? What? I did not know that. That is likely, because unlike my clan, this clan actually sent out a message inviting others to come and help before warping over alongside them. Got some more custom music. That's very cool. You know, it was... After we were gotten to safety, the substance was discovered to expand when hot, but tightly compact in cold conditions, and effectively neutralized by water. Then we waited and watched as several interstellar species working together kindly contained the collector by collecting s the strange matter into various water worlds and comets. Then everyone, including us, all went home. For a while, the eye started sending out its signal. I wonder if it saw... And then it just stopped. So the Collector is Dark Bramble? Okay, had a call with Salon. I'm hope she and Felix are doing alright. So, let me take a look through this telescope and see what this thing is. Uh, glad I have that recording. It's nice to hear friend's voice again. I remember thinking it was odd once the collector was defeated. Friends, elders decided to return home to their moon instead of leaving with the others. I think they were given, if ever, wished to leave schematics on how to build various kinds of spacecraft or machine as customary when encountering pre-interstellar species. However, I don't know if launching civilizations centuries worth of technological innovation forward before they are ready for it is a good idea. Temptation to let technology consume everything, your world and yourself is just too great. Friends elders learned this the hard way, it would seem. Ah, there it is, now to take a picture. Oh no. Okay, something written in haste. I'm gonna see what other stuff is over here first, if anything. a little bit over there. Not sure why that's even... There's some stuff over there. Oh, I think I... 
I think I know what that is. I'm just gonna keep going down the line then. I don't want to spoil it for myself. Whoops. Get out of there, scout. Oh, no, 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 please no. It can't be. Okay, okay, I'm freaking out. When is the, when this thing gets too close to the sun, I have to warn the others immediately to the projection pool. You're talking about the interloper? Okay, I'm recording this at my projection pool now. I tried to warn the others of the comet, but they already knew about it. And I knew Yarrow and I didn't have the best relationship, but I suppose I didn't realize how badly I messed up between us. He, he didn't even look me at, in the eyes. Would it, would it possibly change everything if I was able to warn them properly, or how? It would have only caused panic, distress in their final moments. Maybe it's for the best I wasn't able then. Oh, I can just see about it. The comet, we're all about to die. I promised Felix I would see her again. I miss Solan, I'm growing up, and for what? When I got to the vessel, it was wounded. Perhaps not beyond repair, but... Wait, hold on. Maybe Brittle Hollow Projection Stone. Come on, please be there. Bells! Wait, just let, just let me... Can I be picked up and... And I know the rest of that. Want to be picked up immediately. Spacesuit. Spacesuit. I don't think he was picked up immediately. Ship log updated. It's Datura. You poor, poor thing. Okay, I'm back in my observatory now. The comet, it's here. I tried to get off this planet to at least be with my family, but the shuttles were already both in use. I still can't see this quantum moon. Solana must be still waiting at the sixth location, like I asked Bells to ask her to do. That's good. At least someone will. Oh, oh no, no. Did I. Did I do the wrong thing? We're all going to die, but Solana. When she comes back from the quantum moon, everyone will be dead. She's all alone. This isn't what I wanted. I just. I just wanted to save her, to save someone. Why can't I do anything right? I broke my promise with Felix, I messed it up with friend. And maybe, if I had gotten along with Yarrow, it might not have all ended like this. And now, Solanum, I failed you, I failed everyone. Solanum, there's a chance you, if there's a chance you are reading this, get the warp core from Ash Twin, go to the vessel and leave this place. I'm sorry, I never wanted to leave you alone like this. I never wanted to leave you alone. I wish I'd stayed, I wish I didn't waste all this time. I just wanted to do the right thing, I didn't intend to intend. That's not enough, is it? As I once said, good intentions aren't good enough. I'm sorry everyone for letting you all down. I'm sorry, I wasn't better. No audio detected for 10 minutes, stopping recording. Poor thing. Fuel level critical. Detected. Spacecraft, no my shuttle destroyed. Friends ship destroyed. Spacecraft count two, doors unlocked. Hmm. So if I did destroy my ship here, um it would have let me out. Or in. Yeah. That's a cool mechanic. Alright, so we kind of figured out what the, um, the collector is. Um, 
I don't know if there's a way to visit it. Let's uh, do a little check. Because I think the big, the big exciting part of the mod I might have figured out before this was to find a friend. See if I'm missing anything, and if not, I'm going to end the game. Because I want to see a friend shows up at the campfire at the end. Oh boy. Mysterious planet that spewed out a deadly substance that was contained in the water worlds and comets. Found Detour's body. Projection pool. Attempted to warn others of the interloper, but they already knew about it. Was able to get Solanum to be at the sixth location as the interloper arrived. Then, of course, the eye. It is, is it the creator or destroyer of the universe? Do I want to find out? shirt. How am I going to have access to the ship log when uh, I actually get to the eye of the universe, you know? Like, it's not exactly like I'm able to put the warp core back in. the eye of the universe worth going to. Would you do it? Would you, if able to, would you restart the entire universe? Knowing full well you wouldn't get to see it? It's my chance! 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 Don't let me miss my chance! I don't want to wait for it to go all the way around again. The sand is coming! The sand is coming! Oh god. It's so close. Eh. My timing. I hope my ship is okay. Yeah. Yeah. Artificial gravity. Let's 
go, let's go. It's like, <laughs> the are you sure protocols. Here we go. And yoink. Let's go. Where are we going? Where are we going? Excuse me, sir. To the vessel. Okay, maybe not the sun. This music seems different. Yeah, this is different music. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. Again, custom music. Remixes of all the main themes. Oh, I see. They got in they got elements of uh, the Nomai and the uh, the strangers. Whoops! Overshot it. Yeah, it's the river theme. Here we go. I want to do this one. I didn't even check to see if there's. Oh no. Aha! <laughs> Alright, not my uh, smartest moment. But I did escape the anglerfish. Alright, we're going shipless for the rest of this run. Please no. Please no. How am I supposed to go a kilometer with these guys on my tail? I guess I just have to go until I can't hear them breathing. Where, where can I get this remixed soundtrack? Like, who who made it? Who who made it? And who who can I put money in the hands of so I can obtain copies for my own private listening? Because, like, it is extremely well done. Here we go. The vessel. We did it, and we're only... And the fuel is only half gone. So is the oxygen. I think we'll make it. Suddenly, the end of the world doesn't seem all that bad. But then they, like, twist it with a little more, like ominous sounding vibes all right should be oxygen in here perfect and yup I missed get back here please thank you just yeah
Okay. Um, unable to pinpoint location. I forgot the combination. I think it's like L... I always forget this. I literally just made a video on this. I think that's right. And then this one goes like this. Oh, don't undo it. anything. I think that's right. But when I update my ship log, what happens? I think the deep space radio signal would be able to be, like, honed in on all the way out here. Alright. Almost 3,000 meters to the quantum moon. We can do it. signal blocker there and the new music here new elements mixed with I haven't heard this before Yeah, I, I don't remember um, Andrew Prallo using piano in his original score. The distortions are very uh, Outer Wilds-esque, especially Echoes of the Eye. But it is getting loud, so I'm going to turn it down a tad. to walk the right way. It's just straight. There we go. Yeah, street lights behind the trees if uh I got I, I got to look up where you got this soundtrack from or if you made it yourselves or yourselves. I don't know how big the mod team is, but Goodness, this is DLC sized. Okay, just gotta jump in there. Will it let me do it from here? Yes! I think, I think, I think. <laughs> what just happened? Jump in! We're going in. We're going in. We're trying to go in. We're trying to. No, it does not want me to jump in from here. There we go. Oh boy. Tunnel vision. Yep. Quantum wind. Wait a minute. This is different. This is very different. Stranger's gone. Oh, it's actually showing the destruction of everything, the other Nomai clans. I 
and me? What? What? Did you have to? Did you have to show that part? Goodness. And it's and it's the the twenty six point two billion years song. Memories. The vessel, the quantum moon. What? The vessel crashes into the quantum moon and... What happens? Solanum gets to come with too? See the new universe forming? The artwork, the animations. Everything in the new universe and Solanum gets to be a part of it, but she's all alone. Whoa! What an alternate ending! My goodness. Yeah, I, I still get to go and remake the universe. But, like, they show the emotion. And then, like, the Indiana Jones-style Skull melting on, on the, uh, on the hatchling. And then the remaking of the universe, Solanum gets to quantumize herself into the new world and keep exploring as the last Nomai. It, it's such an experience. It's a lot to take in. The custom music, the custom assets, the artwork, everything. Ah, oh, and 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 like the gameplay, the mechanics, figuring things out. It brought me all back. This was everything I hoped for and more in a mod. 10 out of 10. Um, street, street lights behind the trees. Well done. You and your mod team. Bravo. What, a, what an excellent experience. Um, this was a joy to play. Um, I think I got 100% of it. Um, let me know if I, I found everything. Um, this was so fun to play. This was Outer Wilds, the Outsider mod. A DLC-sized mod by Streetlights Behind the Trees. Uh, thank you so much for watching, everybody. And I look forward to seeing you all next time. Bye for now.